what's up sheeple soon to be billionaire 69 here to answer the question you've all been wondering does Verlicify hate the mentally handicapped I don't know probably not but he is an absolute moron and blocked me from Twitter for explaining why the use of the word retard is seen as bad by others despite me saying I personally don't care what he says and because I was blocked on Twitter by Verlicify for having a differing opinion, even though my opinion is one of complete neutrality, that obviously gives me a free pass to make a hastily thrown together Verlicify Exposed video to cash in on that sweet, sweet YouTube ad revenue, both now and when he inevitably makes a video response or throws a fit on Twitter. Now, there's a lot of concern lately about things being taken out of context. So, for the sake of being transparent, and because I'm lazy, fuck it. Let's just go straight to the Twitter conversation. Here it is. For uh, those of you wondering how I can see his tweets if I'm blocked, there's this thing called signing out of Twitter that's surprisingly easy to use. Something else you may notice is that this tweet is actually from January 11th, which may leave you saying, oh, but if this happened like five weeks ago, why didn't you make a video then, cuck lord? Great question. So, I actually followed Verlicify on Twitter back before any of this happened, obviously, and subscribed to him on YouTube, because, as I've stated, I have nothing wrong with the guy except he's a dumb asshole. But so am I. Now, I actually kept getting notifications of his tweets for at least two weeks after this conversation. I only just now realized I stopped getting them when I saw someone else shit-talking him, which led me to realize, oh hey, I haven't seen Verlicify bitch about anything on Twitter in a while. So, for some reason, at least two weeks after this, he felt the need to go back and block me because I certainly didn't say anything else to him after this. Either that or the Twitter app was fucked and was still sending me the notifications anyways. Your call. So, this right here is my Twitter. Feel free to follow me on there if you want a shit post about me wanting to die at 3 a.m. But, anyways, enough stalling to get to 10 minutes. Let's just read this word for word. <clears throat> read tweets. So this right here is the first one, the one that started all, Holy shit, this guy is so retarded, he thinks you are allowed to cheat if you are busy in life and that a gimmick moveset is cheating. Then we've got some images. Uh, psst, being busy never justifies cheating. That's how life works. Tough shit. Yes, it does. If you don't have the time, I think ginning is a bit quicker and okay, especially if you are smart and know what. When sometimes you even do things that can be taken as cheating. Bit strange wording there. I haven't done anything that is cheating, though, LMFAO. So some of your gimmicky Pokemon setups and your shiny hunting with a game pro aren't? I have no idea what the context for this is. Nor do I even know what half of these broken, terrible sentences mean. But the meat of this is this right here. Him saying that this guy is so retarded. So if we go back to the conversation, we see someone responding here. And interesting note, her at is the only one I can't click on. Obviously, I'm not blocked by her. I'm not logged in. It's irrelevant to this. It's just strange that she is the only at that is like this. Regardless... We'll just get into, she responds with, still not okay to throw around that word, to which he responds with, I disagree. And why is that? I know hackers suck and ruin everything, but that's slightly disrespectful language to be using. To which Verlicify, of course, says, it's not not okay to use the word. I respond with, I disagree, of course, obviously mimic mimicking his non-response of I disagree, and then stating that my next message is in two texts due to the length, there's the second image there. Now you may notice that all of the responses here are underneath the first image, and that leads me to believe maybe he only read the first half, but let's get into this regardless as I talk about this in shitty notepad called college for some reason. 
It's about connotation in the use of the word. Mental retardation is a real problem people are born with, and is significantly worse than someone who simply chooses to not educate themselves or makes a terrible argument. Call them stupid, morons, fucking idiots, but there is no need to specifically say they have a very real and very serious medical condition. It's one thing to use it in specific comedic circumstances, such as with friends or such, because it is not done with the explicit intention of degrading those with the handicap. And now I'm going to move over the second image as it leaves off from there. It's the same reason most people don't see something they hate and say, this is gay anymore. You are throwing it out strictly as a negative. Is mental retardation bad? Absolutely. But the implication here is that anyone with retardation is bad and a bumbling idiot, which just isn't true. I don't care if you call people retarded. That's your business. But as for why you shouldn't call them that, based on the replies of your tweets, this is the best answer you will get. Take it however you want. And that's true. His comments, his replies, they're all fucking awful. That is the most logical answer he would have and did receive. But obviously, as I've stated, I don't care. So this is my response right here. And as we see him respond, get your SJW crap out of here. To which I'm going to have to take a bit of a double turn on. I respond with, Fry meme, because I'm too lazy to Google the actual image for the Fry meme, can't tell if sarcasm or missed part where I don't care. Because originally, I thought he called me an SJW, and of course, it looked like he missed the second part. But now it looks like he is calling me an SJW, because like I said, if he didn't read the second part, he's not gonna see where I said that's his business and I don't care and he's just gonna call me an SJW anyway. Kanadi is playing for honor. So anyways, I, I wasn't sure how to take that exactly to which I responded with, you know what, I'm just realizing you, ca you called what I said SJW crap and not me SJW crap might be fair enough because I said he could take it however he wanted Though, now I think he is just calling me an SJW since he said it was my SJW crap, which just doesn't make sense in the, language, in the English language. I'm having a problem with that myself. If I said I don't care, how is it my SJW crap? Another form of him being an idiot, at least in that statement right there, it doesn't make any sense whatsoever. And if I'm being fair with you right now, if you're wondering why I'm stumbling occasionally, it's that uh, this is a video I actually already recorded this entire rant, and it straight up, there was no audio. So I, I, I guess I said either some stuff I already said or I said some more because, uh, fuck it, it's going and I'm out of things to say. I guess I've already covered what I needed to say there. Nonetheless... Moving on to this conversation, a little bit of bonus. Well, this turned into more than I was expecting. Lovely. Let us now halt this debate. To which I responded, was never a debate and has already been halted. This was about two hours after I made the original comment here. There kind of was, but okay. This is also debating. I don't know why everyone thinks I was debating with him other than saying I disagree. And I stand by my statement that that wasn't a debate. Yeah, he called me an SJW, but I was just giving him factual information as to why other people would think such a thing. So it's not really a debate. This right here, between me and her, possibly could be considered a debate over the fact that we weren't debating, which is honestly a bit of a stretch. And then someone else says, not debating, arguing. How so if I said I don't care what he does? And then this person never responds to me again, so I guess they didn't have a comeback. And of course she responds, maybe not, but it's often frowned upon in response to it's not, not okay. So, there you go. Verlicify blocked me for explaining why other people, but not me, see it being wrong to call someone retarded. Based on him responding to the first picture, maybe he only read that one, which makes him just as in his words, retarded for only reading half of a conversation. Is he right? Am I right? I don't fucking care. I've already made that abundantly clear. I'm just here to cash in on hypocrisy. So, let me say to all of you Verlicify haters out there, 
to the wolf pack, and especially to Verlicify himself. Thank you. Thank you from the bottom of my cold, dead heart for calling someone retarded so I can pay my bills this month. Peace out.